all righty good morning everyone we're back on the s12 today for the install we have a brand new alternator about ready to go in this guy unfortunately did uh had his last hoorah uh, i was leaving the smog center and the car decided to cruise home and it barely made it home but on six volts of battery so might need to get a new battery or at least charge it up but for now Let's get some things out of the way so we can gain some more access to the alternator. It's just two bolts, but first off, disconnect the battery. I like to remove it just so I get more space. I'll probably end up removing this tank as well. And then I'll probably work in the middle. Alrighty, so you're gonna have two bolts. Yeah, this guy right here on top, which is a 14 millimeter if it has not been changed, if it's stock. The very bottom one, which is a lot larger, it's gonna be a 17. And then if you work your way to the back here, sorry, the camera might get inverted, but if you're looking at the back of the alternator, I don't know how well this camera's gonna pick it up, but if you look at the back of the alternator, you have two plugs. You have this guy here, which is just a ground. You have this guy here, which is your hot, and then you have your two wire connector. So the, the hot wire is gonna be a 10 millimeter, which is this guy here. And then you have a ground off to the side, which is like one of these two holes. I didn't really catch that big of a pay, pay attention, but it's just a ground. That, that guy is just an eight millimeter. So some tools, I mean, just basic Harbor Freight, but extendable ratchet, flex head ratchet, 12, take off my terminals because mine are changed. 8 millimeter socket, a 17, 14, and a 10. So, really not hard. At least according to the book, job calls are only 0.8, so not terrible. Alrighty, so whenever you're working in the car, it's always best practice to uh, wash up your area or thin up your area that you're working in as far as any oil, grease, debris, grime, whatever. Make it a habit, run to the Dollar Tree and stock up on this freaking product. I cannot stress this enough. This is gonna be the best thing that you're gonna buy for a dollar, way better than anything you're gonna buy in any auto parts store. Go to the Dollar Tree, go to the cleaning area, look for the brand called La Totally Awesome. The ones that use this and know, they fucking know, let me tell you. So you're gonna grab this, you're gonna sauce the Johnny, like if you're saucing up a brand new freaking sandwich, you're gonna chow down for lunch, and you just cover it with your favorite dressings. Whatever you want to envision, envision it. Look how nice that guy looks right now. Covered, right? So then you grab your trusty, dusty pressure washer wand. And then, go to town. Look at all that crap running. Just blech. And then once you look inside here, ooh, clean. That's how we do it, boys. Okay, so this is the new alternator right here. And if you guys notice, this is the top bolt right here, and it's threaded, okay? Now, the bottom bolt, or bolts of the actual portion of the block, the bolt goes through, right? And it goes through here, but how is it gonna tie in, right? So if you look at the block, I don't know how well it's gonna pick up. Let's see what this flashlight. If you're looking at the block right here, there's no threads at the back of this hole. Okay, so what you're gonna need to remember on the CA20s, you have this special, special looking nut. And what it does is it acts as a spacer and it has the threads inside of there to where you can actually fixate and mount it to the block. Do not forget that piece. That is a super crucial piece. All right, so we are back and if you look, we have the new 
alternator installed. So everything's back in, everything's nice and tight. Everything's tampered seal, 14 millimeter top bolt, 17 millimeter bottom. You have a 10 millimeter for your hot, you have an eight millimeter for your ground, and then you have your electrical connector back there. So once everything is connected, you should be ready to rock and roll as long as you have a good battery. Thanks for watching.